and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carling Gaming Pokemon Legends Arceus Nuzlocke Challenge, where in today's episode, I think we are going to move towards our next uh, noble Pokemon fight, which is with the uh, Hisuian Lilligant, which means we're going to want to make sure we have some fire type attacks, you know what I'm saying? Um, working for us. Uh, and also, I need to give you a quick team update because as I mean, I've mentioned before that Mercury is the obvious leader and still very true. Clearly the strongest Pokemon of the team. Look at this glorious evolved red-eyed lion. Just, just so graceful. However, last episode, we've had to add some new team members here and there. We evolved Grogu into Cleaver. And it has to be, so you can see it right now. There's a little animal, as, a, as an evolved cleaver who feels unstoppable, which is a fair assessment because, you know, look at him. He has literal axe for arms. Uh, literal axes for arms. Um, just feels like a lot more aggressive, you know? Uh, I have to say the same is kind of true of Mackenzie here. Also, that we just have a lot of very aggressive style Pokemon. So cleaver, not really been getting along with like the leadership of uh, Mercury or... Uh, also, just sort of uh, like Luis is that very like obvious other really strong standing I'm team strong member, one. but um, who's very aggressive as such. Grogu uh, just, you know, all, all, all wants to be seen as strong too, wants to be seen as the strongest. So there's a little, there's a little bit of growth there. Uh, nice. Uh, is has been doing really good as the more defensive one has not been so like uh, involved in the conflict You can obviously see Anton over here taking after uh, nice just sort of like yeah, whatever He's so new to the team hasn't really had any time for uh, things to go wrong just yet That's sort of where we are at at the moment. Let's see um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Is there an obvious report to commander Kamado to share what you learned about Ursa Luna? So I guess we actually need to go back to camp at the moment. So, all right, heading back to camp. Let's go. Here we go. One moment, Jay. Oh, well, well, well. Would you come here, please? Uh, am I in trouble? What'd I do, purple hat man? I think I've got, you've got something stuck to you. What's that? <gasps> An unknown. An unknown. Hmm. I found zero of these in my actual playthrough. I'm probably not gonna be doing much hunting of them. Was that a Pokemon? When I come to think of it, Volo did mention that there were carvings that resembled writing on the walls of the Celassian ruins. But supposing that the Pokemon we just saw as a species of multiple forms, perhaps the carvings are actually likenesses of this very Pokemon. I'm going to add a section specifically for that species to your Pokedex, Jay. Okay, all right. Unknown notes were added to your Pokedex. Great. What's this now? Letter-like markings seem to have appeared in this section I've just added. Hmm. And that was your arc phone I just heard? There's a mysterious voice is acting, reacting to this. Okay, whatever. Right, gotcha. We're not gonna be doing that. Yeah, I may as well report the findings. Let's see, we got some new team members. Oh, that's right, I forgot we caught the Hippopotas. Me? Uh, Hippopot- Okay. I guess at the moment it makes more sense to have Anton on the team. But Hippopotas, very good Pokemon. Um, we've already got, you know, we've already got two rock types and a ground type on the team, so I don't know if we need Hippopotas yet, but it's so defensive, it does seem pretty worth it to me in some capacity. Let's see, did we get, did we, are we going to end up leveling up our, uh, uh, I don't think so. Uh, return to the village. I guess we have to go talk to Commander Kamado, or whatever his name is. Mr. Sumo wrestle the first day on the job. Whatever. This is casual. I don't care. Oh, hello. You guys, I was alerted that we need a better nickname for Ray, our rival. So, um, as I completely forgot about it because there's so much less antagonistic in this game, which is a real shame. I really like the more antagonistic rivals, if you ask me. But um, as usual, we name our rivals after um, just un unedible, inedible foods, right? Foods we don't like. So we need we need a name suggestion for our rival, Ray, in the uh, towel section down below. Just whatever food you think he most embodies that you would just despise eating. Let me know down below. We shall we shall adjust this uh, naming issue, as it were, sir. And we're gonna go way up here. Gosh. Oh, 
Oh, look, people are here. Potato Moochie Man. Jay, we have a situation here. Let me explain. Lilligant, our clan's Lady of the Ridge, is in a frenzy. And Arezu knowingly kept this from me. A lady of what? Yes, the only female Lilligant, which makes this honored uh, one our Lady of the Ridge. But this isn't the time for cultural lessons. I'd like to find out just what Arezu was thinking. But she's nowhere in Jubilee Village. Last I saw, she was on the wall for polishing off a big old plate of potato mochi. Not that I blame her, my cookies are irresistible after all. Mm -hmm. Okay, whatever. I don't want to do your voice. It hurts me. Boys, tell me, Commander, if we do end up in a struggle with the Pearl Clan, what will your people do? Huh? Huh? We would be forced to remain neutral. Meaning what? What do you mean, meaning what? It means we wouldn't participate, dude. Well, you guys are lucky I fell out of this Galaxy Clan and not, like, in the, uh... I could call her Saluna. I do have a flute, and I know one song, and it works on all Pokemon, so... Ursulona, so here the Warden Kalaba found you worthy? That's perfect then. Ursulona should be able to sniff out Arezu wherever she's gone. If you are strong enough for that Ursulona deemed you worthy, then you should be ready to quell Lilligan's frenzy as well. I'll hold Lilligan's seat then. Brava Arena, it's called, if you'll excuse me. Alright, see you there. Everyone else can travel so quickly. They're just like, oh, it's so wild out there. I'll just teleport there, no problem. Poof, and then they're like, they're waiting for you. Listen well, Jay, you must quell any Pokemon that could cause harm to people of this UA. Always remember, we came here to make a new home where we could live without war or strife. From where? Where did you come from? Where did I come from? Like, you guys are putting a lot of responsibility on me. I'm like, how do you think I feel? I fell out of the sky and now I'm here, alright? Dude. Here we go. Anyway, maybe we should go, while we're in town, uh, chittle chat with... Uh, the move lady to see if we can get some better moves on some of our new Pokemon. Uh, yeah, let's see. Ba -ba Whoop. Zizu. Boy, she's so tall. Hello there, Survey Koroku. Did you need something? I want new moves. Yeah, let's see what we got in the moves department. What about Grogue? Since we did uh, evolve. Hmm, Calm Mind. Raises offensive and defensive stats. Hmm, interesting. Not bad. We do like things that improve our survivability. Uh, what is our summary presently? Swords Dance. I feel like that might be better than Swords Dance. Yeah. The question is, like, it says it raises offensive and defensive stats. Normally, Calm Mind is special attack and special defense that this is not clear about it so i'm unsure because if it's only raising special attack then that's less good and we don't have that much money maybe we'll well i'm just gonna go for it because uh, yeah yeah let's do it picked it up fantastic all right um let's go let's look at anton select bulldoze bulk up and rest so you also have Raises offensive and defensive stats. Okay, again, good. Uh, we already have Mudbob, Venoshock, Rock Smash, Poison Sting. So, hmm, Venoshock, I think, does more damage when they're already poisoned. Or at least that's typically what it does. Might be a little bit different in this game. Um, Mudbob versus Bulk Up. Hmm, tricky. Rest. I'm gonna we'll hold at the moment. Let's see what else Mackenzie can learn. I'm not sure how long we're gonna keep Mackenzie on the team. Magic Leaf and Rest. What do you already have? Hold on. Yeah, this is not the way to do it. As absorb. So absorb is, it's good because it gets us health back, which we like in this particular playthrough. Stun Spore is also a really good thing to have on the team. So what were the other magic leaf? Mm, I don't know if that's worth it. I don't know if that's worth it. What about, we'll just double check here, check summary. Not check summary, just select Ice Fang. Bulk up. So you might benefit from bulk up. Oh my gosh. As well, baby doll eyes. Uh... Okay. Thunderwave's already really good. That's sort of like our version of baby doll eyes on Mercury here. So I think we're good there. You can get quick attack. Quick attack and aqua jet, not needed. So we can definitely learn something. I feel like bulk up is the way to go. Honestly, let's go ahead and do that as well. Yeah. Anything that can improve our defense, good. 
what I think that's definitely improving our defense and lowering our opponent's offense is going to be very key for um, this particular playthrough. Speaking of particulates, do we have any of this grit gravel we can use? No, we don't. Okay. No big whoops doodles. All right, we're back at bog country here. We have to track down our lady following the scent uh, with Ursaluna, Big Bear, what's up? We're also gonna do some training along the way because we have another big fight coming up. Yay, Cleaver, get that iron chunk. Don't have any, don't have any space in your item, in your satchel for the iron chunk? That's not good because we definitely need. Oh, it must have been something else we didn't have. Wait, what can we get rid of? Lumberry. Uh-huh, uh-huh, mm-hmm. Let's just discard this. That would have been nice to get that. That sparkling meant that the item we couldn't get was the stardust. Yeah, which we need for money purposes because we can't rely on getting money by other means in this particular playthrough, which is usually done by, you know, catching stuff. That's gonna be a little trickier. Let's go, let's go! Yes. We gotta find our way up there. Obviously, but if we want to, we definitely also still want to be. Aha! Uh -huh. A cricket tune, eh? We know just what to do with you, fool. Prepare to die. Keeping its guard up. Yeah, I bet it's gonna run. Give it the old fire fang, Mercury. Yes, return it to dust. Return it from whence it came. Yeah, it's dead. We don't care about it. We hate it. Caster Fern. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Definitely don't want to deal with that guy. That's for sure. Big Alpha Tangerth over there. I don't think so. All right, see ya. Yeah, bye bye. Bye bye now. Is it on to us? good. Let's go ahead and get rid of this guy, though. See you later, Tangela. Get some levels for the whole team here. Go, Mercury. Give him the fire fang. Ah! And it was burned. How did that not kill it? It's so annoying. It feels like it should have. It feels like we should be able to fire fang this thing to its, oh, to its immediate death. We now have. Well done, team. Go, Mackenzie. Remember we would feed it with fire time move. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep, yep. Fantastic. Look at all these sparkle things around here. It's all very good. As it is all look, oh, we're so on the case of something. Because we need we want to fight these things because we want to get the stardust, because we need money. <laughs> stardust iron chunk. Hooray. Oh god, what's happening? We're being rock slid! Something's attacking us. Die, fool! You got it, Mackenzie. Take this thing down. Oh no, there's two things fighting us. <gasps> no, we gotta run. Yes, run away. Oh gosh, mistake. Decided to battle some other time. Abandoned ship. We don't need this. We don't need this kind of stress. Here's what we need. We need to get, uh, we need to heal. Potion on Mackenzie, oh my gosh. Almost destroyed by that. Yeah, that was terrible. Let's go ahead and can we craft some potions? Craft. Yeah, I think we're gonna we're gonna wanna have to need to do that. Let's go ahead. Oh, we can craft a lot of potions. So let's do like uh yeah, like 18 seems good. I'm a, I'm down for like 18 potions. And then we can just go ahead and get like uh Let's do five. I like to do one less so you keep one item in your inventory so that you can continue um, collecting it easily enough. Oh gosh, look at that. It's a freaking alpha hippopotas. Oh boy, there's so many Pokemon over here. It's very difficult to progress without fighting literally every single thing. And they are attacking us. So everything's just, everything's just great. Oh boy. Oh boy, so we need to get to a nice, like, open area. Where are we even going? We're at Sludge Mound. We need to go to Brava Arena. Are we going the exact wrong direction? Oh no. We've gone the wrong way, everyone. We're backwards. Now are we facing the right way? No! Stop it. What about now? 
You're so annoying. I guess that way? No! <laughs> we did a head up that hill. Oh, okay, I see. We gotta go up that hill. What's this person want? Hmm? What do you need? Hello there, so you're the survey corps who acquired Lord of the Woods. Think you could help me with setting up a new base camp? Oh, yes, please. Our Odo could use someone as capable as you. He's fresh construction corps recruit, still learning the ropes. Mm-hmm. All right, I guess we're gonna go up here and set up a new camp now. That'll help us move around the map, though, so I'm okay with it. I'll help you this time, random stranger. Oh, we're gonna have to, oh, look! Are we in a new area? Did we grow into a new area? I don't know. Are we? No, we're still at Sludge Mountain. We're gonna have to fight these guys, though. So we're definitely gonna wanna use Nice. Nice to meet ya. Oof, what a stench. Now we're gonna have to fight these stunkies. The beautiful Noels. Whoa there, I'd keep your distance if I were you. You just look at those bothers. What do you mean? I see no bothers at all. Odo, one stunky would be a headache, but this little group's a full-grown migraine. Well, maybe I can get someone else from the team to handle this. Somewhat good at battling. I mean, I'm not bad. Are you sure you're up to this, though? There's some... S they stink something the fierce. Yeah, just watch, all right? Just sit down. Mm -hmm. Stay down, mm -hmm. Wind. My goodness. Mm -hmm. People have no respect for the mighty... The mighty stunky. Mm -hmm. mm. No respect at all. Let's go, nice! Yeah, we'll take these guys down. Oh, we gotta fight all three at once, though. I do not like this. Not one bit, not one bit. Sunky's looking around. That's good. Don't you dare, don't you dare. Okay, so Nice is doing a good job uh, holding them off. Let's go with Big. Which one is gonna attack us? I can't tell which one is which on the... Like, which one's which? I think we can knock one down. This is not helpful. Not helpful at all. Let's go with that one. It actually hit. Bulldoze! Wreck it! Okay, there's one down. Hopefully we hit one of the ones that's about to attack us again so we get another attack. Acid spray? We don't like that. Mm, don't like that. Another acid spray. Don't lower us again. Okay. We should be pretty good now. Um, okay, so the one in question, I believe, is about to get bulldoze into its next life. Yes, excellent. Well done, nice. Done it again. Tackle, it's gonna do absolutely nothing. And then we just wreck this thing. We have two attacks in a row. Bulldoze. Yeah, we got it, we got it. Three on one, nice to meet you. We have four arms. Nice, nice. Yes. You weren't kidding, you've got talent, and your Pokemon were so brave, too. I can't believe you handled those stunky all by yourself. <laughs> Thanks to you, we can get base camp set up. Now, hold on a minute. Just like that. Bam, base camp set up. Amazing. Oh, well, I guess that was pretty quick. And there's not a whiff of stunky here. All right. Bogbound base camp. Mm-hmm. And this makes a second base camp for us to use in the Crimson Mirelands. Perhaps some stunky will pop by for fun games sometime, eh? Wouldn't that be a treat? I mean, no one no one likes stunky more than me, and that might be true. I don't know. Uh, let's go. Wait. You there. Talk to me. Talk to me. I want to rest. I could use a rest, yes. Just a little while. Just a little heal. A little free heal for Mr. Nice. Miss Nice, I suppose. All right, now where to? Let's do this. Let's just set uh, a point over there so now I can just follow a thing. Oh, see? Oh, Scarlet Bog. Okay, so we haven't been to the Scarlet Bog yet, which means we can catch that Stunky if we want. Or a Ghastly, or a Ghastly. Both great options, both great options. Oh, goodness, though. Look, this Stunky is just like... I mean, it's hard to say no to a Stunky after the beautiful, beautiful Noel we used to have on the team. Am I right? Am I right? Oh my gosh. I don't know if we can say no to it, you guys. Absolutely, we're gonna catch this thing. Okay, here we go. Bring it on. We need to fight it with something that's not gonna, oh, hey -o, look out. No, oh, gosh, it hit us. Oh, oh, I see how it is, stunks. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, and it's a female one. All right, all right. Let's hit it with. Uh, it's gonna. Reach it. Let's hit it with Aqua Jet. I think that'll. That shouldn't kill it. Let's. Ooh. Mm, let's hit it with Aqua Jet. Get out there, Louisa. Don't kill it. Okay. Okay. Venom shot. I don't like that. Oh my gosh, you did a lot of damage. That makes me scared. Okay, we have a heavy ball. Let's go. Let's use the heavy ball. Come on, do it. I don't know if this thing is heavy enough for the heavy ball to make a difference. We got it. Ba-boom. All right. Who? Okay, we have to make sure we name our stunky. When we get that was the scarlet bog. Let me write that down. All right, we will name our stunky when we get back to camp. How exciting, how very exciting indeed. We also need to make sure we give Louisa a quick potion here because scary, don't like that. We are in, we need dark type attacks, it looks like. And who has that, Mercury? You have bite? No, you actually don't. Who has, um, who has a dark type attack? Aha, Mackenzie does, but, hmm. Weren't we gonna change your moves? Yeah, you need bulk up. Set a quick attack. Confirm. Yeah, there we go. I think the same was true of you, right? Air slash. Maybe we got you calm mind instead of sword stance. Yeah, there we go. Super. Super duper. Maybe we should change your moves for a moment too, though. Um, instead of Ice Fang, let's do that. Since we are surrounded by so many ghost types over here. Right, oh gosh, oh gosh. Anyway, just feel like this. Yeah, this is working. We'll just run right through the bog, no problem. In this rain, oh boy, tricky navigating. Onyx! Oh gosh, that'd be quite a catch too, wouldn't it? Heading up the hill, heading up the hill, we got this. Oh, you look like you need help. You look like a diamond team member, right? Oh, Jay, how did it go with Ursalona? I helped him. Thanks a bunch. How'd you find me all the way out here? Ursaluna found you. From the Potato Moochie. You smell- Oh, this is who we're looking for. <laughs> you followed the scent of the Potato Moochie? I ate of the Wallflower? Man, I wish I could eat some more of those right now. Yeah. <laughs> I love how her response is, You smell so strongly of Potato Moochie that I could smell you across a swampy bog. And she's like, Man, I wish I had even more! My lucks were not those, you can most likely tell. I got chased by a Pokemon and sprained my ankle pretty bad as I was running away. It's almost like the world wants to punish me. Indeed. Ah, there you are! Hooray, Zoo, right? Eek! Mm-hmm. Mr. Kalaba, I, d I didn't. I owe you an apology. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, but... It's not your fault that Lily Gant became frenzy, nor that my Ursaluna was so arranged. You were trying to help them both, weren't you? Didn't have the courtesy to listen to you. You think someone who's lived as long as I would be more patient? It's okay, I didn't do a good job explaining myself either. Ursaluna only started acting weird after he got too close to Lily Gant's mother perfume. She was already frenzied by that point, so I'm sure that's what caused it. Ah, that explains the strange powder I found on Ursaluna. It must have been powder from Lilligant. Yeah. Fell and sprained my ankle. Mm -hmm. See, the reason I went through was to get help. I learned about crafting, blah, 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 the bombs, cleaver, yeah, making foods. Here we go. Your galaxy people know all sorts of things. I'd like to learn even more from you, really. Thank you, thank you. Oh, where'd you come from? Well, we'd better take care of our lady and get all this mess resolved first. Yeah, 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 yeah. Adamant! What were you thinking doing this all yourself? Do you think I couldn't help you? Though, no one would blame you for thinking so. Not much of a leader, am I? I've never seen Almighty Sinnoh with my own eyes, and I fail to imagine Lilligan might have become frenzy, too. Listen up, Jay. I'll take the bombs that Arezu made and meet you at Brava Arena. Don't you worry, Arezu. Jay will calm Lilligan, and that'll be that. Things should settle down. Head to Brava Arena, Jay. That's where Lilligan... I'm, I'm reading the wrong people's voices. Yeah, I get it. We have to go fight the Lilligant is what all the all that's really happening here, right? Mm-hmm. Go, Mackenzie. 
I remember the Lilligant fight. I do not remember. Oh, what is this? Can I not get through that? Oh. Well, that's fun. Well done, Mackenzie. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's more Mackenzies over here. I see. You were just trying to get back to your brethren. Are we in a new area? Are we? In it looks like when you would pass through this, that would bring you to a new area, doesn't it? I could be mistaken. Like, that down there looks different from this area up here. But I've been wrong before. It looks like we're getting near... Salacion Ruins or the Diamond Settlement or Cloud Pool Ridge. Though so this would be something up here. We'll be able to catch something else. I'm pretty sure of it. Just wait for the uh, indicator that we've officially crossed into a new area. Okay, Golden Lowlands. We've actually already caught something here. This is where we caught our first Carnivine. Oh, so we're actually pretty near the initial camp, aren't we? Because we just went completely the wrong way the first time. Yeah, that tracks. That tracks. Jay doesn't know where he's going. Classic me. Classic me. Am I right? Uh, how are we gonna get over there, though? So. Boulder Roll Slope. Okay, so this is, in fact, a new area now. Fantastic. We can catch something. It looks like there's just a bunch of Graveler right there, though. So we're definitely gonna wanna... I bet, like, could we take the Graveler down? This is where I miss Flockhart so much, because Flockhart totally would have destroyed these Gravelers. Alas, we are not in a good, like, I mean, we have Grass-type moves, right? That we do, oh boy, oh boy. It's making me nervous, all right, what do you want? Let's see, let's see how this goes. We need to know, because if we come across Rock, to, oh gosh, we are so much level lower level i don't like it oh gosh this feels so risky it feels so risky I, can we take it let's see how because this is four times effective this oh, please don't want to kill us please please don't okay 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 don't go twice oh my gosh we survived Okay, so we should absolutely destroy this thing and get some health back. Oh my gosh, that was nerve-wracking. Oh, not enough health back. Not enough health back, though. Jeez. Oh, Mackenzie, I am so sorry. That was, that was reckless, but you performed admirably. We are impressed. All right, and you're healed. So, whoo, that was scary. That was scary. Man, but we made it. That's the important thing. We did it. Well done, team. Or Mackenzie. Mac. <gasps> a Rhyhorn. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Now that looks like a potential catch, my friends. Let's see, though. There might be something even better up here. So we'll keep that in mind, though. Rhyhorn, a possibility. Rhyhorn is a possibility. Oh, gosh. I feel like... Can we... Do you have different moves? Did we, did we have, like, a... No. We could have given you Magic Leaf, but we... Didn't. We can do strong, st uh, yes. We could do like a strong style absorb in the right scenario. And try and get some more points that way. What is that thing flying around? Is that a toga kiss? That's interesting. That's interesting. Oh boy, I wouldn't mind a toga kiss on the team. Okay, that's got my vote over the, um, over the Rhyhorn. But we'll keep it in mind. We'll keep it in mind. I think so. It could be something even better at the top of this hill. Absorb! Okay, we can knock out the Geodudes, no problem. So we should do that. You, over here. Mm-hmm. Mama Kenzie. Wreck these Geodudes. They don't even know. Number you defeated with grass type moves. See, it's good if we do that because um, we can get more research tasks done. Because we caught a Geodude, which means the research tasks count a little bit more for us. I think we've reached the diamond encampment as well. 
Here we go. Boom. Hey guys. How's uh, what's up? How's everyone? How's everyone? We doing good? All right. Cool. See ya. Are we at a spot where we want to catch? Not a new area yet. So the big thing we're gonna, I think, actually want to be training up here is probably Grogues because um, the Lilligan we're gonna fight is Grass Fighting, which means it's four times a week to Flying. And uh, we are, this is our only fly, <laughs> Flying type attack. So maybe we shouldn't have evolved Grogu just yet until post fight, but it's okay. Um, we'll, just, we'll just have to smash him real hard ahead of time, right? No big deal. Oh gosh. A Rhyhorn, or an Alpha Rhyhorn. We don't want to have to deal with that guy. No, we do not. Let's head up here. If we can get Grogues up to level 30, that would probably be ideal, though. Ooh, another Parasect. Let's wreck it! I do love Parasects, but, you know. Um, easy experience at the moment. Let's go Aerial Ace. You did. Yeah, surprisingly good experience, right? Ooh, Master, that's good for old Nice there. Let's go... I mean, why not? Strong style, Aerial Ace, Kablam! We're obviously already killing it. Um, can't miss. That's the other good thing about Aerial Ace. Can't miss. Can't miss. Very good. Oh, man, just like that, we're almost there. Number two defeated with Flying-type moves. Oh, look, this is more... Um, we should look, actually, real quick at what... We need to do. What are your things? Sometimes strong style move and agile. So we should try and use strong style and agile moves with Cleaver almost all the time, especially while we're out here, because that'll help us with research tasks moving forward. Which we're gonna need if we are to uh, <laughs> advance through the game. Boom, you dead, Cricketune. I'm glad we have some easy things to just knock destroy over here, and I'd never mind knocking out a Cricketune, right? Caught it unawares? Yeah, that's right. Cricketune caught us unawares once upon a time, and we paid for it. <clears throat> I think it actually hit us with Aerialis. But now we're gonna destroy it. Well done, Grogues. Mm-hmm. Harris going down, going down. So this one we can probably just go with the Agile style move, right? Because this is so weak. We'll go Agile style. Boom. Get those research tasks. Yeah, yeah, no problem at all. Even Paris. Keep getting the levels. You can probably take out the Carnivines too, honestly. Uh, let's go. Strong style. Air release! Ka-slam! You're dead. You're dead. Stuff out of the leaves. Go ahead and knock off this carnivine. Ruin its day. <clears throat> oh, it looks like when you do like strong style or something, though, you move like it's like using pressure. Like it uses two of your power points rather than just one. Doesn't matter. We got it. It's dead. Carnivine out. And there you go. Just like that, Grogu up to level 30. So I'm feeling a little bit better about going ahead and fighting. Butch butts. Oh, look at this. We have so many, there's so many more things we can just continue to knock out down here. Um, got the Roselia. That's another good option. We've used Roselias before with lots of success. I'll remember Hamilton, the Roselia, I'm sure. Team leader for our, one of our playthroughs. Um, let's just go ahead and air. Now we're running low on area laces, so I'm just gonna use regular attacks again. But nonetheless, we'll get the experience. Sword cap, mm-hmm. Let's go, running up a hill. Running up a hill. Oh, look at all these stone rocks up here. This is fun. Shrouded ruins, okay, so we are in fact, ooh, look, a Lickitung, so this is a new area. Oh God, my alpha licky licky. What was this place called, Shrouded Ruins? All right, let's write it down. Oh boy, oh boy. All right, all right, all right, all right. 
we in the right area? Yeah, we are. We're in the right area. Gosh. I cannot... Every time I hit the minus button, it brings you to the map. And then I'm so certain pressing minus will bring you out of the map, but that is not what's happening. Now, if I recall, it is possible to catch a Hisuian Growlithe up here, which would be really awesome. Um, but not confirmed. Let's see if we can knock this thing out. We should be able to just destroy this thing very easily with Luisa. Because it is four times weak to water. We are gonna we're gonna strong style water pulse this thing. It is going the hound. Wreck it. Yes, Luis. It's also raining. I'm not sure if the weather affects your moves in this game, but if it is, if it does, then it's helping. Oh gosh. Hi. You dead too. <clears throat> Easy knockouts. We'll take them because everyone gets experience. All good. We need as much experience as we can. Everyone spread it around, you know? Let's see, we should. I'm going to just mark, mark the arena right there. Not that it matters. It should already be marked, right? No, come on. Jump! There we go. Oh, a Ralts. That's interesting. Ah! That's not... Okay, so Ralts is there. Lickitung and Licky Licky is there. Okay, all right. Lickitung, not really a bad option because very just bulky normal type, which is always appreciated in the old Nuzlocke. Um, are we going in the right way though? I can't even tell. Is this the right direction to get up there? We need to go like sort of around. What is the point of being up here? Oh, you can look at that thing. I guess that's sort of maybe the point. That looks like where you might get Spiritomb or something. I see. Okay. Interesting, interesting. How do we get to the Brava Arena though? Do I have to like go over this way? Oh, well, I thought that might do it, but it did not. It looks like we're gonna have to leave this area, so I think I am gonna try and catch the the Lickitung. I've never used the Lickitung before. Let's see if we can um, <clears throat> catch it unawares, eh? As they say. No, go eat the thing. Don't watch me. No, nothing to see here, like a tongue. Maybe it doesn't even. Oh, look at that. It turned around. It's like, yes, catch me. You got the old back strike on it. Let's see. Oh, gosh. Yeah, we got it. Boom. Lick a tongue. That's going to be for this area. Yay. All right. Now we got to figure out how to get over there. I'm not lost. You're lost. I got to get up that hill somehow. Cloud Pool Ridge. Did I write that one down? I don't think so. All right, so there's something to be caught here in Cloud Pool Ridge, too, I suppose. If we so desire, which of course we do. We need to catch as many things as possible. Oh, gosh, look, there's... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There's big, big Rosalia. That's scary. What else? What, what else? Oh, boy. All right, well... There's our final destination. There's some Krikatots over here. Are we ready for the fight, is the question. We've got Sizz I mean, Cleavor, I think, is going to be our, our main go-to, right? That's the that's the strategy. If we need to, we go Calm Mind. If we feel dan if we feel like we're in danger, we can also just Super Potion at any given moment. No reason to feel uh, bad about any of that, right? How close are we to leveling up? Can we get, like, can we squeeze in one more? Let's see. As like, honey, uh, we are very close, actually. So let's, maybe we can just knock out this guy. Knock out one or two more things and just get, like, a nice... First, we're also really low on we can go Silver Wind, I'm sure. That's actually also a good idea. That'll also be super effective. 
Yeah, you did, Rosalia. Get the one more level. Is that going to be enough? Oh, we need one more. One more Rosalia should do it, though. If we can find one. Aha! You there! Stand still and let me destroy you. You're going down, flowers. Oh, it ran! Oh! That's not what I meant by stand still and let me destroy you. You there. Keeping its guard up. Ran away! It's like, it's like these plants are for some reason afraid of this giant praying mantis with literal axes for arms, you know? Like, no courage in flowers anymore. Oh no, why do we... Oh, come on, come on, what are you doing? We should have gone strong style, what was I thinking? Don't be paralyzed, yeah, all right, booyah, we did it, we're amazing. Get the level, get the level. And we do, fantastic. That's what we like to see. Where are we going? Up there, up the hill. All right, don't get turned around, again. You get turned around a lot, I'm sorry. I have bad directions. Bump, 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 bump. All right, Lilligant fight. Are we ready? Are they going to send me on some other errand? That seems to be the trend, doesn't it? Let's see. Let's take a look at everyone real quick. Everyone fully healed. Um, I don't think we can restore power points, but I, I don't think we're going to have to hit it that many times either. Because um, we're pretty strong. Everyone's fully healed. Nice, 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 nice. I think our main goal is just we dodge. Dodge, duck, dip, dive, and... Dodge. As much as possible, as usual, send out Grogu when we can, smack him with strong style aerial ace, hit him hard, get out, continue the fight. That's the, gonna be the main strategy. Oh gosh, but I am nervous, it is an open one. So you've come to talk, I take it that means you're ready. Of course, let's go. I mean, just go crazy. Lady Lilligan's a sight to see, even in a frenzy. Behold her and be graceful. I hope we didn't keep you waiting. Oh my gosh, please don't kill my cleaver. Please don't kill my cleaver. That's going to be terrible. So the other thing is we can't hit it. Oh, mm, this is the real trick is that if it hits us first, it can potentially, well, so we're, the good news is that uh, this is tricky. We're bugs. So if it is with the grass type move, we should resist with bug, but we're weak. So it should be just being neutral. Oh gosh, it makes me so nervous. It makes me so nervous. I think strong style aerialist is just is gonna be strong enough though, because Cleaver is really strong. Or is it tried? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay, we're gonna find out. Gosh, please don't kill Grogu though. Please dodge the moves. That's right. If you keep on dodging, she might get tired out. That'll be your opening. That's when you can bring out your own Pokemon and prove your might. Don't let me down. Okay, that's the other thing. We have to dodge a lot. And, you know, we can hit it with the bombs as much as possible in the meantime as well. Oh, gosh, here we go. Here we go. Noble Pokemon fight. No big deal. Casual. We got it. 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 Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. <clears throat> here comes the wind. Grass fighting. You got nothing. You got nothing. Oh, yes. You're very pretty. Mm-hmm. Very cute. Very acrobatic. Very going down. Oh! Bah! Ta -da! Lady of the Ridge. Elegant. Okay, press the Y button to dodge. You'll become invulnerable to Pokemon attacks for a brief moment. Dodge just the right time to pass your incoming attacks. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh boy. Okay. Looks so like we could be throwing the bombs right now. Yeah. Nope. Don't like that. Keep her around the edges. That's. Uh oh, okay. She's getting tired. Okay. Oh boy. 
Go, Cleaver! Oh, gosh. Can we go first, or is she gonna... Sure, Lily, get your power. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Wait, is it gonna go first? No, don't stun for me. I don't like it. I don't like it. Gosh, as long as you don't get paralyzed, right? Oh, if we do this, it's gonna go twice. I don't like that. We have to. Uh, if we go once, see, we're. Ah, oh, I just don't want to get paralyzed. That would be bad. All right, here we go. Oh god, but now it's not strong style. See, if we go strong style, she'll get to go twice. Should be really bad. But we might only need to hit it once if we go strong style. I just wish we weren't paralyzed. That's where I'm at. I'm gonna have to go for it. I'm going. Strong style aerialist. Let's go, don't get paralyzed. No, we're paralyzed! Oh, it's bad. And our defensive stats were lowered. <gasps> but we got to go again. Oh, we need to items. We need to super potions. We need to do this on Grogu right now. We need to use it on the Grogu right now. There we go, okay. But our defensive stats are lowered, so that's bad. It's using strong style. Please don't hit us with energy ball. <gasps> No! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Okay, okay. Um. Oh, gosh, that sucks. Okay. Acid spray is good. Fire Fang is good. Let's go Mercury. That's swap Pokemon. Okay. Man, maybe I should have used, like, Bulk Up or something. That is terrifying. I am so mad about that. Gosh, why is it always the Scythers? All right, here we go. Um, man, it seems like, should we just go for the Thunder Wave, though? I don't know. I don't know. I feel like maybe we should. Let's go for it. We need to, we need to be more careful. We need, to, we need to use its own tricks against it. Poison Powder. Okay, so that's not good either. Now we're going to take some damage. I don't like. Okay. Or maybe we're not. We're going to go for the Thunder, for the Fire thing here. Oh, man. Look how much damage that did from a non-stab Fire Fang. Like, we absolutely would have just hit it with Aerial Ice, no problem. Here we go, Fire Fang. It's going to knock it out. Now we're going to hit it with the bombs. Hit it with the bombs. Go, 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 go. Throw him faster. What are you doing? That's it, getting annoyed. Uh-oh. Just dodge this. Not close enough. These bombs are a lot heavier than the ones for Cleaver. Just gonna jump. That's gonna be annoyed. Oh, no, go! Oh no, I set up the wrong Pokemon. Oh gosh. Well, this is no good. Oh gosh, we're just gonna get wrecked. No, Anton! <gasps> Okay, what we need to do is actually send out Mercury. Yes. Okay, come back. Are we still poisoned? This is, I bet we're not, because it's not paralyzed anymore, right? No, we're not. Poison powder. So, we're poisoned again. Just like that. That's fantastic. You know, that's, you know, you hate to see it. Um, if we go Fire Fang, it looks like we actually get to go twice, which should be more than enough. So, let's do that. Okay, now we get to go again. We're gonna hit by the poison, but now we get to go again. So fire fang that up real quick. But boom. Yay. Alright. And then actually, oh no, we gotta throw the bombs, right? Boom. As close as we can, so we can reload as fast as possible. Oh boy, here it comes, here it comes. So now we're at least loaded up with mercury to begin with. If I go like this, can I heal? Mercury right now. Yes, okay, that's good to do. Good that we can just do that in the middle of the fight. OK, 
Okay, I think we got it. I think we got it. Can't believe we lost Grogu though. Gosh, this stupid thing. Looks like every time we go through this, it's gonna. Oh gosh, no, that's how we got hit. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. Come on. It's almost. The next time it'll get annoyed and it'll get confused again. We should just already we should just be ready for the Get it? Get it? Come on, Mercury! You got it! You got it! Let's see, what's the turn order here? Poison powder again! It is determined to hit us with this. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Fire thing, we get to go twice, so we should just continue this strategy because it's obviously working. And now it will get hit by poison, but then we just go fire thing again, and we're good to go. Now we're just gonna get as close to it as possible so we can be get as many bombs in as we can. should also do while we can right now is do another quick potion on Mercs. Right? Stay away from this thing. Dodge. It's only hit us once. I think you can get hit five times, if I recall. Let's keep it over here so it has less room to... Nothing. Almost annoyed again. Okay, come on, this should be it. This should be it. If it keeps up its pattern, it's just gonna go poison powder again. Yeah. Okay, that's okay. We know we can do that. And then if we can just hit it twice with Fire Fang, we're pretty solid. And this, yes, for some reason, this lets us go twice. So here we go. We, we don't ask questions. We just we accept. We get hit with a little bit of poison. And then we go Fire Fang. And then we get as close as we can so we can throw as many bombs as possible. That should be it. That should be it. That should be it. We got it. But at what cost? At what cost? Oh, man. Uh, boom. Yeah, we got you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're all very impressed. Oh, yay, we did it. Oh, man. But we lost Cleaver. Freaking energy ball. How do you use poison? The, the stun spore really got me. Oh, my gosh. Uh. Hey, we get the meadow plate. Terrific. A stone tablet imbued with the essence of plants. Wonderful, wonderful. You did just save Lilligant. You saved Arezu as well. I appreciate it. First you're Saluna and now Lilligant, you're amazing. Being all frenzy didn't suit Lilligant one bit. I'm so happy she's so happy. She's back to her graceful self. Arezu, you still owe me an apology. Huh? Eh, don't worry about it. A young one like her is bound to get caught up in some trouble from time to time. Remember, what's written in the Solacian ruins? All lives touch other lives to create something anew and alive. There's wisdom in those words. I imagine they're the teaching of Almighty Sinnoh himself. Of course, I'd completely forgotten about them until uh, somebody helped me remember. <laughs> what day is it? Uh, okay, we owe you one. We got it. All right, yeah, you're all, we're, all, we're all happy together. Tremendous. Yay! Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. I have a funeral to get to. So if you guys could all just, 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 just like, all right. All right. Ah, all our different groups finally join hands to work together. I bet it was a fun day for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got it. We got it. Cool. 
Looking forward to it. Thanks. You'll be up here with Lilligan for a while. Amazing. I thought you sprained your ankle. Seems like you're walking around okay now. Making me do all your dirty work as usual. Mm-hmm. We did it. We win. All right, so what we need to do now is head back to the base camp so we can go have a sad day. Oh, now what? Now what? So a light disappearing. Quelled another Pokemon, yes. Mm-hmm. You have something for me? Let's stay in touch. Great. All right. You there. I want to see my Pokemon. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Oh, Grogu. I was so excited to finally have a Scyther on the team, and we evolved you into your new form, and you were so strong. I had such... I'm positive that had you been able to land that Aerial Ace, you would have decimated that stupid little again. We did special training for it and everything. Oh, now we must release you, and I hate it. <sighs> Oh, that one sucks. That one sucks, you guys. All right. Gosh, 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 gosh. We did catch some new stuff, I think. I'm kind of on team. We got to name some stuff. We have option Denise, but we already have nice, so there's that. We have dark poison. We already have poison type. I'm kind of on team big, bulky, normal type at the moment. So I'm going to move Lickitung over here. And now we got to get some names really quick. Hold on. Pretzel. That's after amateur pretzel in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. And now, who gets the real honor of having the Stunky named after them? That is the real question. Hold on. Eileen. After Eileen Jones in the comments, thank you for watching. Eileen, you have been named Stunky. You are Eileen. Welcome to the pasture, I guess, not the box, whatever. Uh, anyway, this is the team as it stands right now. We've had a terrible uh, loss today, but also a very good victory in the form of defeating our second noble Pokemon of the game already. So things are progressing very nicely. Hopefully the team can come uh, and really like start coming together. Mercury did fantastic today, just launching those fire fangs. We are so fortunate to have such a strong leader on the team as long as everyone, you know, falls into line. Luis said nice. Uh, maybe, I mean, uh, perhaps they, they were already pretty solid with that. Uh, hopefully just Anton and McKenzie can continue to grow in that regard, but uh, it remains to be seen. Uh, but otherwise, thank you so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to leave a comment on, uh, down below so you might have a future Pokemon named after you. Uh, hit that like button if you haven't already. It seriously helps with the YouTube algorithm. And subscribe so you don't miss any future Nuzlocke action. We're trying to get to 100,000 subscribers. So uh, any, any help and support in that direction would be greatly appreciated. We're inching our way there. We are going to make it someday, hopefully in the near future. But until next time, bye! And before we go, just want to give a huge shout out and thank you to all of our amazing patrons over on Patreon. Abby Mondin, Afropunk, Aiden Rudineras, Brianna Bouchard, Bryant, Dakota Ballantyne, Eduardo Bravo, Emerald Phoenix, Gamer Zylia, Gregory Lee, Jade Culture, James Buzanel, Karen Choi, Kimberly Lee, Lauren Alexandra, Luxpa92, Rashaba, Robbie Cruz, Stacy, and 0412. Again, thank you all so much for your continued support over on Patreon. If you'd like to see your name on this wall, you can head over to patreon.com slash Gaming. We also have some other really awesome tiers like our quarterly merch tier and one option to sit down and play some games with me and Ben once a month. If any of that sounds interesting to you, go check it out. Dead spork. <laughs>